Hi, I'm Sergio with Arvig, and on today's Tech Talk, we're going to be looking at streaming audio websites or streaming music websites. Um, these are the kind of things where you go to the website and listen to music, largely for free, but there are paid for versions too, and you can uh, listen to any song you want or tons of music, or it's all like the radio on the web. So why don't I show you an example or two? So the first website we're going to look at is Pandora.com, um, kind of like Pandora's box. Once you open it up, you're going to want to uh, you might regret it because you might spend a lot of time here. But it's a great website where um, you create radio stations and listen to music. It's free, and as you can tell, it's free because it's got advertisements on it. But I think it's worth the trade-off because what it does is you pick a song or an artist, you type it in, and then it creates your own personalized radio station with that information. So um, if you type in the Beatles, for example, it'll probably give you a lot of um, classic rock or um, you know other music from the 60s and 70s. If you type in, um, you know, Eminem, it's going to give you a lot of different rap music. So it all depends on what your tastes are, and I find it's really good at picking those tastes well. A few uh, things about Pandora, you can only listen to it so much um, um, per uh, month, and I believe that's 40 hours before you have to, pay, have to pay for it, but 40 hours is kind of a lot, so I think you'll be okay. The other thing is there are commercials every now and then, like I said, it's advertisement powered, but there's no limit to the number of stations you can create. So I could have 100 different radio stations with 100 different artists and all of them might be a little bit different. You can also skip songs on like the real radio. So if you're sick of one song, you can just go ahead and hit the skip button up here on the top and it'll go to the next one. You only get so many skips per day, but I find it's plenty good too. The last feature I want to talk about is the like and dislike option, thumbs up and thumbs down. Um, if you really like a song that's being played, you hit the thumbs up button and Pandora will remember that for next time and play more songs like it opposite for thumbs down. If you click that, it'll remember that you disliked it and played less songs like that one. The next site I'm going to talk about is Spotify. Spotify is really popular because it's been tied in with Facebook recently. Um, it's only been in the U.S. for a few months, but it's already got tons of followers. The difference between Pandora and Spotify is you do have to install a program. So if you're interested in using it, you'll have to install that. It is free, but they have paid for versions as well, um, and it's powered by advertisements. Unlike Pandora though, you can literally type in any song you want to play and it plays that specific song. Um, it's not like Pandora where it creates you a radio station. Spotify actually plays you know, the exact music you want. So that's why it's so popular and fun. The last thing I, websites I want to talk about are radio stations. If you have a favorite radio station that you like to listen to, um, I suggest you go to their website. A lot of time they let you stream their music for free right on it. So let's take a, a site I like. I'm a fan of kind of um, top 40 music, so if I go to kcld.com, that's a station based out of St. Cloud, they'll have an option to play their um, radio station right on the internet, the listen live button. And I think you'll find it's the same for lots of different radio stations too, so why don't you check those out? So while you're checking those websites out, you'll want to remember that a faster internet connection is good for those. Remember you're streaming that audio over the internet and it takes a lot of bandwidth. So if you don't have high speed yet, you should really get on top of that. Arvig offers free installation, or if you need to upgrade your current package, we'd be happy to help you out. You can get a hold of us lots of different ways. Stop at one of our Arvig locations, or call us at 888-99-ARVIG, or better yet, go on the web and check out arvig.com.